Right, Shalom. First, I'd like to give all praise unto Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, and double honors unto the apostles and elders at Great Millstone, and honors to you brothers out there in the highways and the byways teaching this word in all sincerity and in truth. And this is Romans 3 and 3. It says, For what if some did not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of God without effect? God forbid. Yea, let God be true. Okay, which is word is true. Okay. But every man a liar. Okay, so every every thought, every um uh, um action of a man, if it ain't in line with prophecy, is gonna come to naught. Okay. Everything is gonna happen on the planet Earth according to prophecy, man. Alright, there's nothing any man can do about that. Okay, because the word of the Lord is almighty. And strong, which is Yahweh Shai, man. Okay, so the so-called white man was prophesied um, by the the um, the the, the um, John the John the um, the Revelator. Okay, by by the the um, inspiration of Yahweh Shai, the word of the Heavenly Father Himself, that the the beast, which is the NATO and the EU. Okay, which is the main power block on the planet Earth that's pushing the, the, the global uh, train. That they would institute a system whereby people would receive the mark of the beast, man. Alright, and we know through the spirit of Yahweh Shem Yahweh being the men of the Lord. Beginning with the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. That the mark of the beast is the RFID chip. Okay. And we can identify all the different systems which are being built to facilitate that. Alright? So, it don't matter what another guy's got to say. These things are coming to pass and they're going to come to pass. And they're unfolding before our eyes because it is that time. And the Lord, the Lord himself controls the times and divides the times. So, when it's time for a prophecy to be fulfilled, it's going to be fulfilled not a minute Earlier, not a minute later, man, it's gonna be fulfilled in the time that Yahaba Shami Shai have always intended it from the very beginning. All right, it says that thou mayest might mightest be justified in thy sense, and mightest overcome when thou art judged. So, ultimately, the beginning with the apostles and elders at Great Milson who have been teaching this um, truth longer than us all, they're gonna be justified in their sayings, man. Real soon before the eyes of the people, and the word of the heavenly Father is going to be glorified, and the name of the name of the heavenly Father is going to be glorified, because His word is going to come to pass exactly as it was written, exactly as it was sp said. Because when we're breaking down these scriptures, where that's the spirit of the Lord, man. Whether you can receive it or not, because we didn't come up with them breakdowns. The breakdowns is just what it is. It's the truth. All right. Now, check this out. I just see this from the mirror. It says, new passport rule for Brits flying to US could hit hundreds of thousands as family holiday ruined. Changes brought in last month in the wake of the Paris terrorist attacks, problem reaction solution, could scupper travel plans over the summer. Thousands of Brits with a valid passport can still be refused entry to the US after a change in the country's entry requirements. From the April the 1st these, this year, all travellers to America must have a biometric or e-passport or they won't be allowed into the, cult the country. Meaning you, you, are, you are allowed to, to, to enter America unless your passport has the microchip within it, man. All right. Before this, British passport holders did not need a visa to enter the US under the visa waiver scheme, but had to complete an ESTA form. All passports issued in the UK since October 2006 have been biometric, so anyone with a passport issued since then will be fine. But with 3.8 million British travellers to the, to the US each year, the number of people with older passports could run into the thousands. So guess what? Them people are going to be under pressure now to go to the passport office and buy a new passport, man, if they want to get into America and have a merry old time. Okay? 
So we in that time, man, where this thing is speeding up. It's the year of the push. The Lord is going to bring his prophecies to pass, man. I don't know what the rest of you people thought, you know, but the Lord is going, is, is, is faithful. The scripture says, Yahweh Shai is called faithful and true. All right. Everything's going to go down just as planned, man. All right. 